Before we start this episode, we need to rewind things and go back to this time last year in Siberia. The same crew was exploring the deepest lake in the world, Lake Baikal. The spot was insane, as good as it gets, but getting sessions was a mission and the crew was starting to get tired and slightly malnourished. This made Craig reminisce about his trip to Puerto Rico a few months prior. Puerto Rico had it all. Luxury living, valet kiting, fat steaks, and eggs benedict 17 different ways. Then, disaster struck. Hurricane Maria showed her face with a vengeance and turned PR upside down. Although, it seemed to have brought the community together, and as a whole, the Puerto Rican people came back stronger than ever before. By the time we arrived 10 months later, it was like the natural disaster never happened. But one thing that was prevalent was how happy and friendly the Puerto Ricans were. The crew promptly immersed themselves into the culture. But that's enough rum for these guys. They didn't come to party. Well, at least not yet. They had a job to do, and that was to explore the island for the best kiteboarding spots while spreading shakas and good vibes along the way. So let's see what Stefan, Fran, Noe, Craig, and Aaron got up to on the glorious island of Puerto Rico. I've actually really wanted to come to Puerto Rico since my first years in kiteboarding. I actually heard so much about it. I was really excited to come for the first time and it's just crazy that it took me so long to, to finally get here. You never really check a forecast here, you just wake up in the morning, have breakfast and you see the wind picking up and uh, you don't have to worry about getting on the water at all. You'll be able to kite every single day here. Spots here in Puerto Rico are really good and they're really vast. There's so many different areas you can kiteboard and there's really something for everyone. There's waves right out back here, there's a river mouth just 10 minutes away and I mean we've been all over the island. You go to all these amazing spots and most of the time you're kiting there by yourself or maybe a couple of other kiters which is really cool. The one I liked the most was the flat water to the mangroves. Mangroves are pretty sick. And found this amazing flat water spot just behind all these trees. Really unique setup for a kite spot and it was pretty insane. When you go to the Caribbean, it's pretty easy to post up on the white sand beach with the turquoise water, rum punch in hand. But if we had done that here, we would have missed out on all that Puerto Rico had to offer. 